Hello gamers and inters, and welcome back to another Legends of Runeterra video. Today, we are playing Mono Mordekaiser, um, with some interesting cards. Mainly, these two cards that we started off with. Um, Proliferating Darth Wraith is a card that um, I haven't really seen much play, and I really like the design of it. So, um, yeah, we're going to use it to potentially uh, scale up, use it as a kill target for Iron Hounds and Hate Spikes and stuff like that. Um, so we can uh, hopefully try and get some value from it. I've already killed a Yi, so that's good. This is game one, and say it with me, kids. We always keep game one in. Game one remains. Okay, if you're going to pass, I'm going to pass. We will play Lord Malat. Pawns need a guiding hand. Wow. You are vulnerable. That's uh, pretty good. We get Malat down. We will get uh, Revenant down. And then... We'll Iron Ham the turn after on the Malat, and things will be pretty juicy. Good craft is not so, we do this. I cannot aid you in your revenge, Revenant. Then be gone or be dead. So, playing this to get Flow. Gotcha. Okay, they're passing, so I will also pass. Um. Ooh, I'm not gonna lie, this hand is kind of juicy. So, we have Malat with Challenger. Maybe not for this turn, but the turn after. Maybe it was a call to um, target this then. So, we'll see what the opponent does. I mean, they're playing a very slow deck. Are they gonna play Glorious? Okay, so I think I'm forced to do this. And then we have 5, 13, 15 damage. And they have 1 mana, so if you have a Mystic Shot, you can't do anything. Did we did we do it? No. Damn it. Oh yeah, because Mystic Shot one mana because of a. Uh... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Makes sense. Makes sense. Uh, so we can still push a nice amount of damage. Root canopy and the glorious on one turn. Pretty rough. The impurities. So, we'll do that. We have Mordecai's next turn. Um, and then we have Eris in the turn after. Ah. That seems to be a problem. This game went from very winnable to... Oh shit, I've lost. What did they do? Turn 6, they got Canopy. That dies. Um. So we're alive. Barely. I don't think I have anything for to stop it, right? Damn. This is a bit of a rough one. 
Yeah, unfortunately, I cannot uh, stop the cheese that is the uh, elusive Yi. But fair play to the opponent. This is a bit of a Mimi deck anyway. They're only a Mimi deck. I think we're allowing them to take the win there. But it was close. Very close. Okay, Ash and Vex. Let's see how we do in this matchup. Ooh. Um, as long as we don't draw the other Dark Wraith, this is a good hand. And because we have both, I'm going to keep them. So, let's see how we do here. As soon as we draw the other Dark Wraith, it's, it's over. It is big over. Okay. Um, sure, we'll play this. Death, ruin, vengeance. So any unit with Death Buster gets killed by Mordekaiser. Obviously, he's going to come back. Um... Like he gets printed. So. Well, I don't mind cards like this dying. This Blade Pierce Revenant is a really weird card. It's. I'm not quite sure where it sits in the tier list of Mordekaiser cards. Okay, so we at least kill one so it goes back in. That's alright. So we have this and a Death's Grasp, which is always good to see. The funny thing is, like, if opponent's waiting to play Ash, we just block with this. If you play Vex, it's a bit of a different story. Wow, okay. So we will go Mordekaiser. Okay, we'll do this. Push the one damage. I don't think they have fast answers. They might have the death grasp of their own, but we'll see. Um, gloom. And I can't think of anything else. Okay, so. Ooh, nice. Very nice find. So they do have a card that is deathless. Rather be anywhere Not than the Vex. Here. Huh. What is peculiar? Um, okay, let's do... Oh, one card. I don't want them getting Gloom. So... So stupid. I don't know if the mist is still in standard. Let me do some research. Oh. Okay. Thought that we were going to answer my question for me. There is no end. So. There we go. And we get to play Mordecai's now with a three mana bank, which is always nice. So, kill and kill. Free draw. Ooh. Uh. Fairly sure that prints him. Like, I'm very confident that prints him. As long as he still has Deathless. No! Okay. Uh, I guess we'll do this. What could they do next turn? the world on one arrow. Okay. Uh, I'm fine because if that Ash attacks, we'll just kill it. And then we'll revive the Mordekaiser and then I don't know what this guy's going to do. Stand together. Leaping into action. So we'll do this. Continue we'll revive Mordekaiser.
I got Malat. Hollow hearts and dying dreams. Um. Sure. So I just need to kill two units. So play oh, this. Do not fail me, Are your rewards and punishments so different? Kill two, two allies. Sorry, should I say. Uh, so let's get rid of the ash. We might have a flash freeze. We don't want that. I am not done with you. Malat Brenton. Let's go. Um. And then we do this. Oh wait, which one is it? That gives us one. That gives us two. So yeah, we'll do this. And if they kill Maud, we still have mana to play um, another one. Like, if they ruin Asian, we get the Deathless one back. So, we'll have a target to kill. Ooh. Boom, oh, Ruination. Do it for me. Hit me with the Ruination. Hit me with a Vengeance. Hey, yo, what the fuck? Hopefully they just aren't holding Vengeance. Okay, so they tap out of Vengeance, which is nice. So we'll do this. Beware, my lord. Mila comes for your armor. Do I look concerned, Malat? Ooh. Finally get to do the uh, Malat printing. We've got a one mana four four. They could flash freeze. Yeah. There's not a lot they could do though. So let's the dream let the draining commence. Yeah, I uh, I too feel like a LeBlanc. The funny thing is, if they harrowing next turn, we just block and we kill everything, and um, yeah, our opponent just uh just dies. So. No, not the glare. Um. Yeah, I think they. Uh, I think they know. So we get the win, and Malat and Mordekaiser hold hands and skip into the distance for their victory. A very solid game. Okay, Revelian Soul and Elder Dragon. So a bit of a slower game plan, um, which means we could probably keep these cards. Um, we can look for the turn six, turn seven play. Um, yeah. And we'll have Mordekaiser, so the turn after we could potentially play this. Which is turn eight, which is the earliest they can play Age of Dragons. So... Triple Mordekaiser. Ooh. If they get the obliterate, that does beat us. So. Ooh, an excellent find. Thank you. Gives me something to play. We live in times of wonder. Okay, so they'll go to six mana next turn. Uh, we need to have at least one unit alive, so well, that's pretty good for that. Does my ass look fat, my lad? Unseen forces are at play. Um. I hate getting my hands dirty. So we'll do this. No, no. Now it doesn't really get any good blocks, so... Can 
do this. Next turn we have Maud. Okay. Okay, so potentially looking for the uh, the daybreak card. Um, so what we can, uh, not the daybreak, the obliterate card. So we can save the hate spike to uh, kill the Mordekaiser to save it from the obliteration. So this goes here, this goes here, this goes here. So I hold this to be safe. Okay. So next turn we can flip the Mordekaiser. They're really looking for the uh bot rate, I think. It was my heart that let me hear. So see what we can do. If we can get a double Mordekaiser flip, that would be really cool. Alright, here we go. So we do this. There was hope. And now we'll use the uh, the hate spike on this one, and this one will resurrect it to full. Okay, fine. So we do this onto this. Nice. So Mordecai's is gonna level. We'll get double um, death realm. And then even if their first card is um, Age of Dragons, we just completely ignore it. Uh, pull, pull. Um, I mean, we might as well attack with everything. So even if they get good blocks, it's really good for us. Back heretic. Okay. This is like super difficult for them to come back because it's for every kill spell we have now. Like this is just drain two immediately. So yeah, even though you have the high show, you're not really gonna get much much done. So yeah, if you play Aurelian Soul. They think themselves cultured. <laughs> And, um, yeah. I mean, I could literally just do it on this and it will heal the Mordekaiser. We have two answers for, uh, any answers. So, yeah. The rare Aurelian Soul Flip. It's not a card you see, uh, level up often. But if we get like top deck another spirit leech, we just have burst speed lethal. Okay. Well, I think we have lethal. I mean, we also have lethal just by playing this. So they have one action, and they cannot win the game from one action. It would have to be a burst speed deal twenty. Yeah. So we just do this. And then if they have an answer, we play this. And if they have an answer, we play this. Right, they, were, they were screwed from the moment we got two Mordekaisers out. It was uh, kind of over for them. But very strong win. We got to play Lord Malat. And we're feeling great. Huh. Garen looks Gallium. All of them 
are mastery five, which makes me even more curious. What was your mastery points? Three hundred and okay. This he's a gamer. I like Garen, but this guy he's a true Garen gamer. I wonder why he's gone to Targon. That's where my curiosity arises. Hmm. Pill Cascade for draw. You can go for the spirit card over there, the three, four mana, give two spirit. Was it three mana? Oh. Interesting. I'll let you deal two. Two's okay. I just want to get my malats down. My plan is in motion. I wonder if this is using. I mean, it must be right. The I can't even think of what the card's called. Let's see if I can look it up. Veiled something. It's called. Veiled Blessings. Wasn't far. Far off. Um, we'll deal the damage. Play the other Malats. Start blocking down. Because remember, we want to get Mordekai's leveled, so... Well, um... We fight for those who cannot. And light the way for those who are lost. Defends its own. So uncultured. <clears throat> so we'll just block like this. No, no. We'll just pass just in case we try to single combat or anything. Um. Yep, yeah, we'll do this. Very, I'm intrigued. So, three Garens, so we gotta play around a judgment. Through the darkness, I see something new. Hope. So, we can counter that really by giving that gloom. I can choose the box, that'd be pretty pretty good for me. How long was I out for? Too long, but that I'm glad you're back. Is rough. So we can do this. The one of Galio? Maybe it's a two 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 though. So Um They gotta have something. I'm just trying to figure out what I'm trying to play around. This is the thing. Cheese decks will always get the win somehow. Oh, we stop the Galio level. That's one thing. So I think what we can do is play this. I cannot aid you in your revenge, Revenant. Then be gone or be dead. And then revive the Iron Hound. Hmm. No place. Where's Mordekaiser when you need him? The 
the force to block. The only issue is I think this Garen is going to become an issue. So... Yeah, there were seven over. So we deal five. Can't be judgment. Okay. Perfect. Literally perfect for the Galio level. Yeah, we can't do anything to stop it. No rest until the battle's won. So we need a death grasp. We need to like try and play this. We'll do this. Vengeance is great. Because I don't think Maybe they do run Bastion. I mean, what am I, how am I supposed to know what they're going to do? So we'll safety block like this. Oh, safety block like this. And that doesn't even rally them. Okay, that rallies them. We're not pushing. We're not pushing any damage, really. Must be play something that's big. So we'll pass. Cause like this blocks this, this blocks this, this will happily block this. It just comes back to life. This is like even if you play this Jarrell, I'm not. Okay. Still think I've got decent blocks. I fear. Bleed and shatter. So that was there. There is no end. So we need to play this on here. Everson is really good, actually. Wait, Everson does kind of win us the game a bit. Hold on. So they're forced to gem this. Um, and then even then, it's not even lethal. Uh, let's do this. Oh, we, we can drag it to the side as well. Hold on. Oh yeah, they've got a very specific thing they're gonna have to do. Huh? Okay, I'm glad we uh kept that. So as long as this isn't a single combat, we're okay. Okay. That scrap is fine with me. So we'll do this. Then we'll play this. We'll go super wide again. This has been a, an interesting match. Let's just say that. They got 
a really good hand, and we somehow managed to uh, hold the line very well. Right. Um, I mean, we're always just doing this, right? Um, I'm another farm up. <laughs> Look at the gamers. Um, let's do this. Looking for that Mordekaiser, baby. Where are you? Where are you? Where is she? Okay, they surrendered. But we did get the win. That was a very interesting matchup. I'm very curious to see what the deck is there. Um, because I'm not quite sure what the finish was there. So, I, uh, I'm very intrigued to see. Oh, it's an Alter to Unity deck? They did have a Bastion. Mahera. Okay, wow. Well, so they're just kind of playing like a weird deck here. Well, that's what I mean. They, they got very close to winning there. We just got very lucky. But uh, yeah. Hey, we managed to survive, so that's one thing. 